is my book review of A World of Curiosities by Louise Penny in five minutes or less. I'm author Nancy Basile and I write cozy mysteries. You can download the prequel of mine for free using the link in the description below. I listened to A World of Curiosities on Audible and I highly recommend listening to all of the Inspector Gamache series on Audible because the narrator is chef's kiss. It's spring and Three Pines is re-emerging after the harsh winter, but not everything buried should come alive again. Not everything lying dormant should re-emerge, but something has. As the villagers prepare for a special celebration, Armand Gamache and Jean-Guy Beauvoir find themselves increasingly worried. A young man and a woman have reappeared in the Sûreté du Québec investigators' lives for many after many years. The two were young children when their troubled mother was murdered, leaving them damaged, shattered. Now they've arrived in the village of Three Pines, but to what end? Gamache and Beauvoir's memories of that tragic case, the one that first brought them together, come rushing back. Did their mother's murder hurt them beyond repair? Have those terrible wounds buried for decades festered and are now ready to erupt? As Chief Inspector Gamache works to uncover mysteries, his alarm grows when a letter written by a long-dead stonemason is discovered. In it, the man describes his terror when bricking up an attic room somewhere in the village. Every word of the 160-year-old letter is filled with dread. When the room is found, the villagers decide to open it up. As the bricks are removed, Gamache, Beauvoir, and the villagers discover a world of curiosities, but the head of homicide soon realizes there's more in that room than meets the eye. There are puzzles within puzzles and hidden messages warning of mayhem and revenge. In unsealing that room, an old enemy is released into their world, into their lives, and into the very heart of Armand Gamache's home. Have you read Louise Penny's books? Drop me a comment below and let me know. Tropes included in A World of Curiosities include not a suicide, serial killer, detective slash cop, and small town. I give the story rating of A World of Curiosities now what? But I would do that with pretty much every Inspector Gamache book. Louise Penny is an incredible writer. Dialogue, I rate at HBO drama insights that you get from the characters that Louise Penny writes are just gold. Characters, again, trust with my life. I feel like I know these characters because this is the 18th book in the series. I've read them all and I feel like they jump off the page and they are all my friends. The setting, I also give top rating for A World of Curiosities at Here's My New Address. Who does not want to live in Three Pines with the B&B, &B, with the bistro, with the bookshop, with the boulangerie? Gasps for A World of Curiosity. I'm only going to give it a four because I actually guessed the killer before it was over. Now, I didn't suss out all the details, but I did know who the murderer was, which is rare for a Louise Penny book. My final verdict for A World of Curiosities is five stars, for sure. The Inspector Gamache series is one of my all-time favorites. Uh, I would have to say Jean-Guy Beauvoir is my favorite character just because his journey has been one of redemption. I mean, he worked really hard to come back from a really dark place. The, the whole series is beloved to me, and as soon as they come out, I listen to them. Um, I read the ones early on, but once I discovered them on Audible, I've never gone back because the narrator is just so good. If you find this book review helpful, give me a like and then subscribe to this channel so you get more book reviews just like this one.